Hello, everybody. Today, we are looking for a cat that I just heard meowing. No, actually, we're not looking for a cat at all. We are looking at TPS Domes, which is a server. And the link will be in the description for my website, which will have the address and port for the server. Um, basically, oh man, there's rock down there. That's horrible. That means I'm stuck. Basically, what we have on the server here is a series of domes, hence the name. It's actually... Um, my mouse... Okay, I don't know what just happened there. My mouse was not working, but it, it is now, so I'm not sure what that was all about. Uh, it is mainly... I want to say it was Dwayne's Loud Walking mod. So it makes these big domes that have an unbreakable wall can't it will not break with any tool uh dynamite maybe would i don't know i've never tried that i don't even know if dynamite's on here and they're all connected by i don't know what that is but that does not sound good these domes are all connected by these pathways and uh, each dome has its own biome in it so we were just in like a s sandy biome I'm assuming and now we're in a wooded biome the the center of each biome and you can't even really see it because it's too far away um, Okay, I've increased up my viewing range and I still can't see it. But you can see it on the mini map. That white block up at the top. That is. Um, it's like a control center. If you climb up. If you climb up to the top of it, there is an area with some random blocks that you can punch and they do different things. Sometimes you'll get teleported to. A random location sometimes they'll explode in your face and kill you um, so yeah I mean something you want to be cautious about for sure uh, but yeah it's kind of your basic server it doesn't seem to be anything too out of the ordinary here it is PvP um, so something definitely to keep in mind if you are not one that wants to play pvp of course there are there's enough pods here that you could easily find one and probably have people leave you alone uh, you can protect your stuff so I, I would imagine it'd be relatively easy to get yourself a pod and uh, what am I calling pods for? I'm calling them pods because in the game that, or in the, the mod, that's what they are. But they're domes here. It's a dome. I need to remember that. Robbie stressed that I call them domes. And now I call them pods. And that's why it's called TPS domes. Because they're domes. Is that where we just came from? Yes, it sure is. Well, let's go the other way then. There's a... There's a couple different mods mobs a couple different mob mods on here uh, you just seen the slime obviously we got a badger and a fox over here in some of my precursor precursory gameplay uh, I was attacked and killed by something we just heard there it is again I have no idea what that is, but it doesn't sound good. Like, that sounds creepy. Sounds very creepy. Alright, so we have a dome here that's uh, mostly water with some sand. Now, I don't know if everybody spawns in the same dome or if you just spawn in one randomly. Because, well, I only spawned as myself. 
so I, I can't answer that question. But, uh, you know, it might be a good idea to to grab myself a wooden sword. Uh, you know, stone would be better, obviously, but should at least have something, I guess. And I'll go ahead and make a wooden pickaxe so I can get some stone. Um, it's not too many different mods on here. We're pretty much looking at, you know, like your basic basic stuff there's not too much we got uh, I think this is more blocks yep more blocks we've got some different wood patterns and stone patterns there and then <laughs> I guess we have a, a jackhammer and a chainsaw but I don't use a chainsaw to oh here we go a diamond steel block coal block and copper ingot to make a chainsaw glowing fungus i'm assuming that's just something that's underground we got some different foods apple pie that's always good and then we've got our different few mob things there meese crystal which is green okay gold lump gold ingot gold block so we're looking at pretty much our standard stuff here there is basic machines from uh, i believe r d made that mod so that is here as well. It's kind of meant to be used as Technic is used. So it has kind of the same kind of the same stuff to it. But uh yeah, it's different. Yeah, it's something you have to learn. I personally have not used it very much, so I do not know how to use it actually. So I cannot explain that to you at all I don't know what that is but it sounds like it's something mean so we're gonna do what any smart person does and dig a hole and this is complete I cannot see anything like legit this is pure black I just need to get some more cobblestone um, I can make charcoal by cooking wood in a stove and then I can put two charcoals together to make a coal and then I can use that to make a torch okay why can't I place this Oh no. I just placed it, but I don't know where. No, 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 no. I literally cannot see anything. My screen is just pure black right now. I can't see a sky. Oh wait, I should be able to point at it, right? Default stone, default stone, default stone. Where did that furnace go? Okay, then. Yes, this makes for a super interesting video. I'm sure everybody is just thrilled so far I'm gonna have to try to make another furnace and see if I can't make it work this time <coughs> oh excuse me um yeah let's hope as soon as I get this torn this furnace placed there we go and then I throw some stuff in there. It'll light up. Uh, really? It was right there? That's horrible, man. That's horrible. Alright, so I got two charcoal. Uh, coal lump. Wood charcoal. Wood charcoal. So why is that not...
That's weird. Well, let's try this. Oh. Okay, so we need a torch that way. Okay, now I was told... That's actually not a bad texture. I was told that I should make a mine and there would be something cool with the mine. So we're going to go ahead and switch to the radar. And now you do not have to worry about digging all the way through, like to the bottom of the dome and falling out because the bottom layer is made of unbreakable material. So you are relatively safe as far as anything like that goes. You're not gonna fall out. You can't fall out actually. And yeah, it's, it's not horrible. Now, of course, I made this long tunnel and I really don't have any way of climbing up. So what I'm gonna do is make a sneak ladder. And all you do to do that is alternate which side you take out and then you jump and hold shift and you'll climb right up it. And then you just, yeah, pretty much alternate in a crisscrossing pattern. And you get to the surface. And then you just fall and hold the shift key to kind of slow yourself down. Okay, there was... <laughs> there was definitely something out here I heard. But I don't see it anymore. So I'm going to grab some of this wood. Just because I'm going to need it to make sticks so I can make some more tools. And then we're going to jump back in this mine. This is actually a horrible place because it's right under a tree. So I don't even think sunlight's going to shine in too much. See there I didn't hit shift soon enough, so I took damage from falling. So you can not avoid it, but that time I didn't. Ooh, what was that? Okay, it looks darker, but I guess not. Okay, it must have just been the lighting that made it look darker. I would like to find some coal, because that would be helpful. Can make a lot more torches that way. Okay, I was under the impression that there was going to be a bunch of caves in here. But I'm not seeing any caves, so I don't know. There was supposed to be something great about caves. Now I haven't found one. Oh, that's my that's my selection box, making it look darker. That's what's doing that. Okay, well, no cave. <laughs> 